My name is James Bolden, and I'm the Publications Editor for the International Horn Society. We're very excited about the latest issue of The Horn Call, our official journal. To tell you a little bit about their articles, we've arranged for brief video presentations by several of the authors. I hope you enjoy it, and I hope you'll read The Horn Call today. If you're not a member of the International Horn Society, please visit hornsociety.org to join. Hello everyone, my name is Dr. Davith Bevel and I'm the Associate Lecturer of Horn at the University of Wisconsin Whitewater. I wanted to make this short video today to tell you about an article of mine that's going to be published in the upcoming October edition of the Horn Call. The article is titled A Horn of Many Colors and it covers the history and role of the horn in film music. If you're anything like me, film music and especially the amazing horn lines often heard in film scores is one of the main reasons that I chose to play the instrument, and it's still one of the most inspiring things for me to listen to today as a professional player. During my doctoral studies, I wanted to research how the horn became such a prominent and versatile voice in film scores, and this article is the culmination of that research. In the article, I write about the origins of film music, the composers that brought it to the forefront of orchestral writing, and the amazing studio hornists which have inspired generations of us horn players to, to, all the way to today. In fact, this entire issue is going to be dedicated to one of the greatest studio hornists ever, Vince DeRosa, who is turning 100 years old this October. If you're a fan of film music, or even if you're not, I hope you'll enjoy my article, as well as all of the other fantastic and informative pieces in the next edition of The Horn Call.